Hi guys, welcome back. Okay, so in this video, I will be time traveling for the very first time. No way! It freaking worked! <laughs> no way! If you have been watching my videos, you know that I really need Marshall or Ioni on my island. Basically, I need a cute squirrel. And to find one of them, I'm going to be using the campsite method. So in this method, you will be time traveling to a day where Isabel says that you have a campsite visitor and then you go and see who it is and if you like them you take them if you don't you will have to time travel again and again and again and again and it will probably take a long time so it was painful and that's why the villager that I'm going to find will never leave this island <laughs> So if you don't have a life and you like to torture yourself and you have several hours to spend, then this could be your method of getting the dreamy villager. But yes, let's do this. Let's go. Let's time travel for the first time. Okay, so first you will time travel six days and then you will have the best chance of getting a campsite villager. And after that you will time travel one more day. Hi Isabel, looking good. Okay, so we didn't get a campsite visitor on the first try. That's okay. Let's jump one more day. Okay, so yes, this time we have a villager. Let's go and see who is our first time traveling villager. Oh my god, who is it? Okay, Nana. So that was the first one. So let's see all the villagers that came to my campsite. No way! It freaking worked! <laughs> no way! 
No way! Oh my god, it freaking worked! I got Marshall! Everybody, Marshall is coming to my island! Yes! Come home, Marshall! He's perfect! I love the purple ears! I love the swirly tail! I love the pink cheeks! I love the cheeky eyes! I love everything about him! Ah, okay, okay, okay! Let's save the game! I read somewhere that you have to do this, save the game when you find a villager and that way if they choose the wrong villager to leave your island then you can reload the game. Marshall, what will it take to get you to this island? Okay, let's play a game. Let's do this. I have the worst luck in this. Um, let's let's go red. No! No! Just keep talking to them and eventually you are going to win one game and they will come to your island. But Marshall really needed some serious convincing. And he really didn't make this easy for me. So we had a lot of lovely conversations and we played a lot of card games. Yes! Okay, yes! We did it! <laughs> Finally we did it! Yay! I'm so happy. After all this, I feel like I have really earned Marshall. Some people may feel like time traveling is cheating. This was not easy, it took a long time, but it was really worth it. It was so worth it. Okay, and then the next challenge, who will they choose to move out? Oh my god, Profina? That's perfect! That's exactly who I want to move out. She's the one I would have chosen, yes! This is going so well. So this was the first time I time traveled and I time traveled a lot. So let's hope I didn't screw up my whole island while doing it. Okay. And then I time traveled to next day to see that he is really coming and he is. The plot is sold and Profina is gone. And I time traveled one more day to get him to this island, just to be sure. Oh, here he is. Marshall in boxes. This is one of the most important days in my life. Okay, let's travel back to the current time. So synchronize to the amazing internet. And let's see if everything on my island has been messed up. Okay, here is everybody on my island. 
and there is Marshall and he fits so well to this crowd and I'm really starting to like all these villagers. Here is his cute house. I liked Profina's house as well, I have to say. Hey Marshall! His house is amazing. It looks like we have a new cafe on our island. I'm so happy. Yes! Do you like Marshall? Do you have Marshall? At this time I have 250 subscribers and I really want to say to you guys that I am very grateful and so happy and thank you so much. Okay, I will see you in the next one. Bye!